Yo, yo, what's up? Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Of course, I go by the name DJ Easy Beats. And of course, it's still a late night show with your one and only Elenu and Seaman. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome, guys. It's a crazy house tonight. It's still the late night show. And you know how we do it. My name is Elenu. I'm your husband, your guy, your boyfriend, and your nigga twice. Of course, the president of the LMP party. Yes, sir. Uh, hey, I am Simi Adeju Ma. I'm not bad on to bad day, to fly us, to amazing us, and also the VP of the late night party. You must be wondering why we're so excited tonight, because we have African Dance Queen coming up on the show tonight. She is a world Guinness yeah. break. World break, record breaking. Yeah. Record Guinness breaking. record. She has broken a Guinness Book of World Records. She has broken Guinness Book of World Records. Uh, she yeah. broke the record, Shaq. She <laughs> shall broke her record. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, she's none other than the one you all know. The very beautiful, sexy, sassy, dance finest in Africa. Our own dance export material. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, DJ, make some noise for Kathy! <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I only have energy for one hour. I got the dance. Hour. <laughs> <laughs> you know I can take you for longer. I know, yeah. I can help you. That's why I don't want to um, go more than one hour. More than one hour. Yes, that's the only time I plan. But you know, if you bring right it... I've already used 30 minutes. Okay. <laughs> so in case, in the course of the show, in case you notice, I'm not talking too much. It's because 30 minutes. It, don't go. Exhausted, yes. Okay, don't go. No problem. <laughs> <laughs> how are you guys doing? I'm welcome, good, we're welcome. good. Well, how are you? Nice Great. <laughs> Gabby, how do you have the energy? I don't understand. Trust me, I don't understand. Oh, wow, well, yeah. Either. We yeah. all don't understand. And, I mean, like, <laughs> so earlier on, we were trying to describe how you broke a Guinness world record. Yeah. Not the book, but you broke a record. <laughs> yeah, world record. Yes. Obviously, not the book. And you danced for like 53 minutes, 40. 54, 54, 40. 40. Mm -hmm. yeah. Wow. That's two days plus. Yeah, so, yes, that was it. I, it was really amazing thinking about it right now because it wasn't something you pre plan in your life. Like, okay, let me go and rehearse for two and a half days because I'm going to dance for two and a half days. It was more or less like a, a mental decision that let's go and do this thing. That don't, don't, don't doubt yourself. And that was how it was. It was how crazy. How do you keep dancing for two days? Wait, what happens when you need to use the toilet? You have to you earn dance the, the time. Oh. Yeah, you earn the time. Then you, you get a five minutes break, but you have to dance an hour to earn it. You have to dance for one hour to earn five minutes break. Yeah. So now for you to be able to manage the time that you are given. You have to keep saving all five minutes. Mm -hmm. But it's also dangerous because at a particular point, because of the law of diminishing returns, you must not rest so much so that the kinetic energy you require to go back in will not drop, or else you just you will not be able to go back in. Wow. So you I've need never, to rest, but not you mustn't rest wow. too too long. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. I, I never knew there was mathematics in there that. Is wow. a, there is physics, maths was wow. all in Wow. Wow. And Every, how many, how many everything people? I learned in science class, wow. I had to use, yeah. How many people exactly were there dancing? Okay, the thing is that to increase the chance of Nigeria, you know, breaking the record, they had to try 120 individuals, divide them into four groups, try as much as possible to make each group as, as strong as possible. Uh, also try and look for relative um, common interests that they will all share to try and keep the group together as much as possible. So because we, we want to, we're looking forward to the breaking of the record. It's as more of breaking of the record rather than them competing against mm. one another. Mm. But at the same time, the competition gets everybody excited enough to say, we don't want to be the one quitting. Do you understand? So the logic behind it is to keep driving you to want to succeed. So we had a group that has a lot more dancers than normal individuals. We had a group that has a lot more athletes and a mixture of dancers and normal individuals. We had a group that has a lot more of uh, fan, fans of dance and all the arts, and a group that just had regular people. So we're just trying to you know, try out different levels at the same time. Wow. So you mustn't lose seven members of your oh, group, this of your team. This is making me sweat. When, when you do that, your group is disqualified. So you had like two groups got disqualified because they couldn't keep their team together. Wow. wow. Is, there, is there a particular dance you have to do? There or is no do dance, any, my sister, because when you are supposed to be moving continuously, you make up. Even and, it does, <laughs> and it doesn't even, get to a particular time when you're so tired, you're just moving your head. No, you can't just move your head. You have to move the whole body momentarily, at least for a second. You must move the body from side to side. That is a lot. So if you like, keep doing this for the next 24 hours, you must, you must move one side of your leg. You must lift one leg, one side to the other side. So even if you're moving, you cannot just move. You need to move from one, your weight has to shift from one side to the other, or else you'll be disqualified. 
Wow. So, and I find um, it difficult running up a, a flight of stairs. Um, I can't. What else are we supposed to do now? <laughs> I'm already tired <laughs> listening to that. <laughs> okay, let me quickly, okay. Uh, quickly put you on the spot. Um, okay. Don't think about it. Okay, don't think. Don't think. Don't think. Don't think. I'm on the spot, but don't yeah. think. Just answer the question. Question. What English word is most times spelled incorrect? Go. <sighs> <laughs> so don't think about it. <laughs> I don't know. I've had cases where even just IS has been spelled incorrectly. Yeah, well, yeah. You understand? Because I was in the examination room and someone was like, how does it spell it? It's like, which one? Like, H-I-S? Like, H -I -S? Yes. Is it H-I-S? Oh, I-S? Yes. <laughs> no, it's that brain freeze at that moment. Yeah. So Let's see how many people had yeah, that Yeah, we tested brain other people. Freeze. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Only one person got it right. There actually. is a particular word. There's a particular word that's that always misspelled. Yeah. What English word is spelled most times incorrect? The English word that is what? Spelled most times incorrect. Ah, I can't, I can't say. What English word is mostly spelled incorrect? Incorrect. What English word is spelled incorrect most of the time? Um, uh, I can't word. tell. Yeah. What English word is mostly spelled incorrect? You have 10 seconds to answer me. Thank no. You. What English word is mostly spelled incorrect? Uh, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> incorrect is mostly spelled incorrect. Incorrect is mostly spelled yeah. incorrect. Incorrect, because you have to spell it incorrectly. Because it's correct. Because <laughs> it's incorrect. Exactly. exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't want to take it as a trick question. So <laughs> Come on, guys. We have the dance queen of, of this continent. Yeah. Our own expert material when it comes to dance. Kathy, the queen of dance here in this part of the world. We go for a quick break. When we come back, we have more exciting segments. to the late night show like this boy has always run out of energy because we have a special dancer here who's been dancing around in circles around his mind in his mind <coughs> <coughs> what's she talking about nothing right. it's kathy <laughs> you keep quiet i beg Strong to you. i beg i beg as if you weren't already dreaming about her before she came onto the studio oh yeah yeah mm -hmm. for yeah. a long time yeah, in my life a long yeah, time. yeah. yeah. <laughs> Mm. Even yeah. I felt the dream. You know when somebody dreams about you and you and can so almost strong. see yourself casted. <laughs> <laughs> you just felt like, ah, your agent, Alpha now. You get a job, <laughs> Helen is <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I so Kathy, so. growing up, you grew up in Canada, in England, in Egypt. At the same time. At the same. Yeah, I like the way you just went, took me around the world, dissected and my whole. New Delhi, uh -huh. New Delhi as well. Okay, uh, yes, I was everywhere, basically. Um, how did I even start? It all started with the whole England, then the US, then Canada, then uh, Holland, then New Delhi, Bombay, North Korea, South Korea, like that, everywhere. Then finally, Niger, bus stop, stay here, be here, you know, dance here. Dance here. You understand? That's yeah. how it rolls. Yeah. Keep it here. That's how it rolls. Yells. Yeah, keep it here. So basically, I think because of my parents, they were more into like business of trade. And that way they get all their merchandise from m most of these countries. So there's always this requirement because we're really, really young. That, oh, who's going to be in charge of the kids today? So, okay, you know what? I have to just travel with this bunch or I have to travel with this. Um, probably one of those sets that went at a particular point in time or the other. And each, each visit requires like a month plus mm -hmm. and all that. So, yeah. Okay. That's why I'm like everywhere. All right, so now, like meeting you now, finally. Yeah. Like you're a very energetic person. You seem very happy, very bouncy. Yeah. Are there ever times you're like, you know, <clears throat> yeah. stern, you're tough, especially with the kids as well? <laughs> well, I, I uh, let me just say, it's all embedded in the way I take things. Uh, in all that um, vibrancy and energy that looks very fresh and friendly, it's always, what kept it going is that, uh, you know, behind it. So it's like the mask for the uh is the huh. Do you get it? But mm. the huh is sustained because the uh is there, there all the time, you know, firing, keeping you on point, focused and checked. So most of the time, people who come by me, work with me, they know that, okay, there's a line there in all of that niceness that we mm. shouldn't cross. 
You understand? Oh, you know, like I, I might be really, I might be like outgoing to the public, but when I'm at home, I really, really, really like privacy. Okay. Like quiet, because all my life is noise. When you go out, is music, talk. You just have, there's just moments where you just mm -hmm. don't want to do anything. You just want to be on the bed. That yeah. one hour, that two hours is just your time, you know, yeah. I want you to give Eleni that look. You yeah. know how he was, I don't know what he was thinking about, but you were shy in his mind. Yeah. So, like, give him that, like, I'm look. judging you, well, yeah. you know. Like, what kind of look now? Like, what what do you want me to say with the look? Like, who do you think you are? Who like, you I'm you are? judging you, like, even for even talking to me. I, I don't have that look in store. Really. Are you sure, Kathy? I don't have the who you think you are look, but I, <laughs> I like, I have the... You don't have that kind of look, like, like, like I'm judging you. you look at somebody to, like... No, I like, I have the look of, you know, the look where you doubt me? Yeah. You underestimate me? Yeah. That's right. the look I'm giving you right now. It yeah. always comes with a little smirk. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, guy, mm. you're doing the wrong thing. So you, you be, yeah. let, let, let's say you, yeah. you, you are the judge of this and, and you, yeah. you have to make a decision. Mm. What's, what's the look like? This is the look. Mm. That's it. It goes like that. That's the judge. Mm. Yeah. There's a, there, you know, there's a look for the man you don't, they mess up big time. Mm. And everybody knows that, seems to know that look at home. And they were like, oh, mom is giving that look. And I'm like, please tell me what that look like. I don't even know how to do the look, but they say I do it. That every time they do, they're about to do something wrong or they did something wrong, you don't know I just how, have that look. You don't know what the look looks like? I don't know what the looks look like. It looks, it looks like this. Look at this. Yeah, that's a look. That looks like a, what in the world do you think you're doing? <laughs> yeah, that's a look. Same so your mind, in yeah. your mind now, you're doing something right, really. Please get off my stage. Who was yeah. this right look directed to? Hey. I pity the person. Ah, I, I pity the person <laughs> too. <laughs> I can't even remember because I'm sure it's a moment, you know. And that was on Project Fame stage, actually. So I know it's definitely a look. To, do you know what? Funny enough, when I'm on that seat during Project Fame, the looks I have, it's not just directed <laughs> at the contestants. Sometimes it's the dance because I provide the back backup dancers. Yeah. Sometimes it could be the dancers, or it could be the band just making a mistake in the arrangement, mm. or it could be the contestant where I go like, "This is not how we planned it," you know. But I'll get you backstage. Don't worry. So the look could be for either one of them. It could be for the band, for the dancers, or for the contestants. They're like, we'll deal with you when we get back. Don't worry. So that look is scary. Yeah. Uh, don't worry. I don't know how to put this question, but does your dance know no bound? There's no bound. Don't, that's why I try to even explore more of what I can do because I don't even think I've been able to um, tap into what is in here. It's like even my body is a limitation to my mind. How do you dance when you're pregnant? It's, it's amazing. You know, I know women all weak or mushy or tired when they're pregnant. But it, it happens to me too. But at the end of the day, you need to live your life. And uh, I try to make a statement with while I was pregnant because in the African culture, when a woman is pregnant, she's treated like an egg. And not an egg in a very good way at most times. An egg in the sense of don't move, don't touch, don't jump, don't walk, don't scrub, don't do, do you understand? And, you know, as, as an advocate for wellness and fitness life, uh, you are doing more damage to her body than good when you do not allow her to have an active pregnant life. You know, once you have, you know, escaped the stage whereby it's quite dangerous for the fetus to be moved around mm -hmm. uh, here and there, it's quite, no, in fact, it's advisable to be as active as possible, especially as much as your body can allow. One thing you don't do, don't overstretch what you are not used to prior mm. to pregnancy. You, you now do it during pregnancy. You know, that's killing it. Because you're already, your body is already a manufacturing, like, manufacturing enterprise. And right there, all the engine room, every, everything is working. So you are in great demand of what you require to get that whole human being to function in your womb. So it's actually demanding and tiring on its own. Not to talk of somebody who has not been prepared physically prior to that. Mm. So for me, I could do what I did with my pregnancy and go that length because naturally I'm f physically fit to be able to oh, do yeah, that. Oh, yeah, obviously. Yeah. Like, darn it. To the, to the like, I, I was Now, you just gave that, uh, yeah, right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That was the one you gave that, like, yeah, all right, yeah. Just darn yeah, it. Like, I, was, so. I was, like, planning, like, when I get pregnant and stuff, yeah. I'll be, like, the laziest. I was planning, of, yeah. I was going to be like, uh, no, darling, no, 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 please no, no. pass me like the remote gonna, that's over lazy. there. <laughs> I you're beg. Actually, you're actually lazy without pregnancy. Uh, so I, can always, I can already imagine. Well, <laughs> you, well yeah. you guys out there and Kathy be the judge of who... Is like no, no, I'm just saying. Genetic. I'm genetically situation. pregnant. Yes, this is. This is <laughs> yes. 
That's how I was beat. This is a genetic situation. Okay, behind all those boss lady, you know, yeah. you being the boss and the rest of them, have yeah. you ever blushed before? Have anybody ever blushed? made you blush? Like, like, maybe a what does it look like when you blush? A celebrity crush, maybe. No. Oh, uh, well. Uh, really? Yeah, yeah, that's one of the look. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're catching me away. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Wow. Okay, um, I am very shy, un unfortunately, because you feel like you're making, you're doing that to me right now. <laughs> that when I'm put on the spot, I can be very shy, get embarrassed like that, uh, because uh, most of the time I am comfortable with my zone. So when I'm in that moment where it's not really my zone, you can really catch me blushing or embarrassed, like not able to, I can be very shy. Do you understand? Especially, or maybe I'm, I'm having to dance to just one person in the room. I prefer to dance to 5,000 for 5,000 people than one person. <laughs> it's somehow, do you get it? But um, my husband makes me blush, you know. And the uh, other celebrity uh, crush? Celebrity crush. In international or local? Celebrity. Celebrity. I used to crush, but ever since my husband came into the picture, it's been very difficult to crush. He just crushed the crush. Uh, you guys, you guys are. It's a Tori Day. It's not a celebrity crush. You are serenading, serenading me up here. <laughs> it's a boy I admire so much. Do you know what it is to just see young people do so well at their craft, and you know, for that age to be recognized as a superstar already. For me, you don't understand. This is what I try to give back in my in my own establishment for young people. Well, well, it's not about Tori. It's not about Tori anyway. It's about the, it's about it's about the blush. I can see some pink in your cheek here. I had to. I'm an actress, yeah. man. <laughs> this is not acting. It is. It's you like, know. I was like, okay, let's go. Boom. Oh, let me. And, and, and the last thing, like, yeah. the statement I made before I said, let's, let's make your teenage fans go crazy. Oh. Right. So I'm like, let's do this to make them go crazy. So I was like, oh, that I need to put on my, this is the word I said, I need to put on my high school first kiss by her crush look. Right. Yeah, and that's you what I did. It. You nailed yeah. it. And you I was like, it. you nailed it. Yeah. Oh, come on. Okay. Have you ever stolen from any cartoon figure before? You know, like your music. like your dance moves and everything. Like, yeah. okay, so you know how like comedians sometimes they steal people's jokes, but yeah. have you ever like stolen or gotten your own inspiration like for a dance material from where? For I don't. I don't know. Like anywhere. Like. You know, just stealing I get, I get dance moves. No, there's one thing I don't like to do is to just take a move. And just make it mine, as in just uh, like copy it back. I like to make it mine in a way. You can be inspired by a movement or a style. There's a lot of people I'm inspired by, Janet Jackson. I'm inspired by MJ a lot. You see it. Uh, I love the old school hip hop with the pops and locks. You understand? Those are styles, just like you say, R&B exists. There's rock music, and so in dance you have genres of dance that are mm. styles. But I would not want to dance exactly like you. Like, even if I dance the shoki, for instance, we know shoki's everywhere, but I would, I would rather like to find another way to do mm -hmm. the shoki that makes yeah. it like, interesting. From what we've been yeah. seeing, anyway, your, 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 dance, yeah. your dance moves are very similar to, like, we found, like, another person who has moves. Yeah. And your dance moves are very similar to this individual as well. It's possible. It could be just the face. And who is no, that? No, it wasn't just the face. It was, uh -huh. like, the, the, the movements, the positions of the... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It was just a natural. That was more coffee. No, that was more. more. That was more. Uh, that's yeah. more. I, of Spider Man again. Maybe, I don't know. Bless uh, it. Who again? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> no! Oh, you even have cute you. That's more. Yes, uh, wait, why is it all action figures and why him? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. God, this is interesting. I never considered myself a spider chick. <laughs> yeah. uh, spider you. chick, spider chick. Spider chick, spider chick. <laughs> we know where you from, no. spider chick. I'm from Niger, my spider chick. <laughs> yeah. Check out, check out the spider chick. Yeah. Now, there's this dance move that was you know, all around at some yeah. point in time. They call it twerking and the rest of the yeah. I don't understand. Now, like you said, you take yeah. a dance step and you make it your own. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I saw this video. And mm. uh, I don't know what was happening here, but... Okay. It was... Don't shock me again. Don't shock me. I'm not going to shock no, you, no, but no. you shocked us. 
Ah, uh, is it me? Yeah. No, 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 this is to me. Put you shocked us. You shocked us. Where? Where? Yeah. Video? This is the this is twerk twerk revolutionized. <laughs> Yeah, oh my God. Oh, I see <laughs> you killed me. Who oh. twerks out of oh. my mouth? <laughs> Hello? Oh, there's a story behind There's a story behind that. Like, that, there is... I can explain. Okay. okay. I can explain. Yeah. Please explain. I'm listening. Okay. Uh. Okay. Okay. Like... <laughs> <laughs> I like to work out really much. And um, most of the time, I like to come up with... Uh, uh, workout movement that dance related that can also have total impact on the muscle group that are involved in it. Do you understand? So I wanted most of the time when you twerk, you're here, right here, and you control the muscle. Mm -hmm. Your quads, your calf muscle are required, and your glutes maximus. Your glutes is what actually you control. Do you understand? You can actually isolate those 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 muscles. So I wanted to add a little level of difficulty to it. And I wanted to see what it feel like in reverse. And you know, with good arm strength, you can also work your shoulders, your, you know, your pecs, your deltoids, all at the same time, but you're concentrating on dancing. Do you get what I mean? Um, so for um, me, I'm looking at it from a very scientific angle, but it was fun. You know that scientific fun angle? Uh, you can't, I can't even well, last two, two and a half minutes. I have, no, I have no understanding whatsoever. So yeah, of course, I share what you're just saying. Oh, I don't know what she's talking about. All the twelve, the bikes, the of tights, course. the whites. But, <laughs> but when, you, when you do, look do at you it. Do you understand this? Oh, no, 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 you no, look no, all beautiful no, to yourself. No. no. I, no Say you you people who do, you are, <laughs> all of you who are into the fitness training, you understand this grammar. But, I've never heard this grammar before in my but life. But I'm, I'm, I'm educating He's you. Educating. Oh, yeah, He's this is, I'm just that. I'm being truthful here. OK. Yeah, this is the first time I've heard it. You're not seeing any education. He is no, so many twerks, twerks, and <laughs> your packs, the packs, the packs, and the <laughs> Yes, yes. I, I only and packs. it helps with your packs as well. Uh, my packs? I don't have packs. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's, yeah, it's no wrong for you to use packs with me. No yeah. pack zone. Yeah, yeah, this like yes. amusement park. Yes, I like that. Uh, that's maybe maybe with Easy Beat we can get <laughs> four packs, <sighs> or let's say two and a half. Two and a half pack. Yeah. Okay, okay. We'll, we'll, Maka we'll, likes you anyway. The yeah. way you are, she likes you. Let's go. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, yeah. You put on the see the blush right there. Yeah. Yes. See it. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, Maka is real. Blush. Uh -huh. Amaka is not real. I don't even know where she got that from. Amaka. Well, yeah. Okay, so there's a project yeah. you're working on presently. Yes, it's yes. called Joda. Mm. Yes. What, what, what is it about? Is it some form of dance move? Yes. Uh, basically, I've always been teaching fitness dancing, you know, dance fitness and stuff. But I was not smart enough to, at that time to package it like Zumba did. Do you understand? And I was really thrilled at how Zumba started from a very humble, small, rural, cultural community area. And before you know it, the White House is all doing Zumba, the whole country, it's even infecting us in Africa here. And it's basically a Latin-based uh, workout. And I was like, what have we been doing? Our music is crossing all over the world, you understand what I'm saying? People are loving Afrobeat music, African jive and pop and stuff. Uh, let's, and our movement is peculiar to our sound. You know, it's not like mm -hmm. uh, you're going to be waltzing on, on the are you going to dance? So you're gonna, there's, there's a groove that the, the African uh, movement music creates, and it's very peculiar to us, you mm. understand? So I was like, having a workout, dance workout based thing like that will also work. So what I did was I said, look, it's tested and trusted in Nigeria. I know I've been taking classes for years. People love it. It's not a problem. Let me go out there to see if it will do it. Because if I want a product like that, I also want it to be international. Do you understand? So I, I did a tour United States uh, last year. And I did five cities. And I did London. And people turn out, you know, and everybody had a testimonial like, oh, this and before you know it, are you coming back are you coming back okay I'm like you know what for all of you that came you're gonna get free DVD so I had produced but I was hoping to I finished the edit as at the time I left but see since May last year I'm just releasing it uh, like two three weeks ago you know it took it's a long journey to try and get so you don't want to do it right mm -hmm. even if it's your first try you want it to be good so that you can challenge yourself for the other products that will come out. Well, I'm one of I'm I'm I'm, I'm a great uh, fan of dancing. Of course, yes. I think I'm going to I'm going to look e into it. You I'm need going, to I'm try Ijoda. Yes. Yeah. and it's so, quite delivered. It's delivered in such a way that you can relate with it. Mm -hmm. I, yeah. I also wanted to just like break out from the. Form yeah. I want to, to break out from the norm. You know, when you buy an average aerobics uh, DVD, mm -hmm. there's a, there's a format at which it's presented. I wanted to have our own Nigeria format. So when I'm talking to you in a DVD, it's like Alpha, you get a. Uh, Should I go back? Okay, okay, let's take it again. Nice. So let's, you nice, know, so the nice. lingo. Then I add some, uh, some catchphrases that help you remember the move. Like there's a there's a there's a routine called Key Mosquito. 
Do you understand? Mm -hmm. When you're learning it, you start by learning catch and put, catch and put, catch and put, catch and put, slice, 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 slice. Watch out! Watch out! You know, so, okay. I can yeah. understand the whole. If, if it's time at the end of the show, we'll all like. Yeah, yeah you do that. Keep mosquito, uh, keep mosquito. Yeah. Yeah. Keep mosquito and cut meat. That's that's my own input into the. Even my son thing. knows that. My yeah. son, when he sees the uh, the sign of his jaw, I'm like, each other, each other. Oh yeah. Then I go, katapu, katapu, katapu. You know, I know. I wish I brought him on the show. You see, this two and a half years old boy, three year old boy doing one of the routines. He knows Eminado. He knows Skilly. Oh, wow. You know, because I have like uh, six or seven routines there to challenge people, there to learn it. And the beauty of the workout DVD is that it's a workout, but the way the dance is structured, if both of you know it, the moment you hear Skeleru in the club, you're done. You like, it. you know that's our move. Mm -hmm. All, both of you just have the same move and everybody will be like, so I'm trying to make you cool. At the oh, same we're already time cool, as but yeah. Yeah, we're, yeah, we're, cool. we're, yeah, we're already cool. So let's take a quick look at one of the, um, <laughs> where one of the cities or in Lagos in Nigeria where Ijoda stormed and let's see the turnout. out. <laughs>